aspect of the divine. The thing that makes up everything. Your DNA, what's in you, goes all the way back to the creation story. Mm. So you're here for a purpose. Here for that divine thing that you need to do. Now what is divine? Divine is everything. Right. It's, the, it's the greatest part of you. Bring it down. The greatest part of you. It's who you can manifest to be. It's you being the Christ for you. Mm. You know, uh, the, the mystery, the mystery that is you working on discovering you. See? So when, when, when we sit around and we don't, we're not working on anything. And what are you working on? Well, I'm just trying. No, man. We need to be doing it. Mm. You don't have to, you know, you, you're doing is what makes you exist. You're doing is your, your reality of what is. What is it all worth? It's worth you. <laughs> your experience that you're here tr trying to experience in this cosmos, in this earth, in this space, in this time, your existence, your purpose for being here is your existence. What is it? It's mm. the fullness of you. Right. What brings out that fullness in you? You. Your hopes, dreams. So take time to discover those things. You know? It's that oneness. You know, it's that balance, that mahat. You know, the thing that balances you. You know, you have the feminine energy and the masculine energy that creates a balance in nature. All of nature is designed like that. Fulfilling it, that's why people have an urge to mate. Why? It's a natural thing. To mate with the opposite sex. It unnat becomes unnatural and confusing when you, you go against that. In that, in, that, in, that, in that state, you know? So, as we learn this, these things, we're discovering ourselves. But what keeps you in balance? What is it, Dad? It's the opposite. Mm. You know? Right and wrong. Wrong and right. Well, Good and bad. And, and now the discovery is. I think what it would, we I think know it would, right it's going wrong, for was male and female, but okay. What, what we know is right and wrong, haves and have nots, black and white, rich and poor, mm. good and evil, is something that was, in, is being interpreted at this point, is being interpreted through the eyes of how we were trained in our environment. Our, our, our religious beliefs that we thought was ours, our thoughts, our history as being told, we have to be a discoverer of ourselves, you know? Mm -hmm. We have to discover ourselves. And that's the whole experience here. Discovering who you are. Mm -hmm. what, you, what your purpose is. What your life is. What is your life? Are you just here to eat, sleep, poop, work, and then die? And, and worship? And what is it? How does it, how's it, what does it mean to you? How is it going to mean something to you? Mm -hmm. How's it gonna mean something to you? That's how you make rice? That's how you make rice. Oh. Wow. See, you gotta touch the rice and you know, you know, wash it. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is, well, that's the, on, on making the perfect rice. This is brown rice. <laughs> this is <Both> ways, <laughs> motivation speech to a cooking show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it's it's all about us. Mm. It's all about the message that you 
are bringing every day with your existence here. Mm. You know, this right here is part of nature. It's the thing that's in rice, the plant, the grass that produced this. It's the same thing that's in you. Okay, the energy that produced this is what we're going to be harvesting for the energy that sustains our life. Mm. It's part of that cycle, you know, it's understanding that. Understanding that balance. 